Ty Green, middle linebacker for the Kansas Fairview Cardinals, future back-to-back -back state championships. And um, just remember this face, y'all. See it in about five more years. Football is like, man, it's my life. I mean, that's what I live for. I, mean, I just, I want to be great. I'm going to be great. I want to be a champion. All this kind of stuff. Take care of my family. That's something I love to do. First time I love football, I was probably about eight or nine. I was always playing with my cousins in the backyard. That was always bigger than me, so it just made me want to lift weights and get bigger and compete with them. But, you know, they was all older than me, so when I competed with the people my age, I was always, always one better than they were. More events and things that they weren't, so it just made me a better player in the long run. Okay, the first thing I do when I wake up in the morning just have to motivate myself, you know, do better than I did, do better than what I did the next the first day, you know. Make sure I'm just, you know, getting better every day, you know, just making strides or whatever, you know, because, you know, it's just a, it's a process, you know, to just getting back to where you once was or even better. You just got to, it's a grind, like a 24-7 grind, you know, I just get up, you know, do a stretch and, you know, give me protein shake, some bananas or whatever, and I just, I run, and then I go hit the waist for a little while, and I just do it consistently. And daily routines when it comes to rehabbing my knee, and I'll just wake up in the morning, stretch, you know, get a couple leg extensions, hamstrings, all that, you know, just get my full range of motion back, you know, just not doing too much, but you know, just doing enough so I can, you know, get it back right. You know, you don't want to overdo it, because you can, you know, end up tearing it. You know, I'm just trying to be patient, you know, because I'm impatient, you know, I'm just trying to, you know, do what's best for my future right now. But, you know, you got to do what's best for you, because, you know, if you get hurt again, you the only person that got to live with that, not nobody else. So, you know, I just get up, rehab, you know, stretch, get my full range of motion, and just, you know, try to build my muscle up, you know, build my muscles up in my leg, and get it strong enough where I can compete at the level I was once before, or even better than I was before. It was work out with Ty Green, I say probably about 10 sets of 10, 225. Uh, squat, probably about shoo, five sets of 10, do incline. That's just one day right there. And then I run about two or three miles. About it right there. And then I just max out on bench after um, I would have messed out on bench after I get all my work did and see where I'm at. Right now I'm currently at 400 pounds. Hopefully I get more than that one day. I feel like my senior season gonna be pretty good. I mean, my knee all together, I mean, I'm feeling good, you know. I'm um, hoping to give me about 200 tackles, probably about 15 touchdowns, and just, you know, returning myself even better, you know, and just go out there and hurt people. Basically, you know, make them feel tight green. But I just want to accomplish my goals and get a state championship as a team first, get team goals first, and then just get my individual goals and just, you know, be able to give me a scholarship one day and fight, play college football. What do I plan on seeing myself in five years? Oh, y'all got ESPN, don't you? <laughs> what I plan on seeing myself probably on somebody NFL roster, you know, being a starter, you know, just doing what I want to do and doing what I love, just taking care of my family, basically, plain and simple.